thought I'd uh, go down to the seafront, see what's going on. Um, got anything going on yourself? Well, I'm going to work in a bit. Bloody and Claire's asked me to go in, and it's meant to be my day off. Well, uh, try and enjoy it. Fat chance of lads. So you don't remember me. Olivia Stevens was there. Stevenson, close. <laughs> I can't believe it's you. Must have been what, just over ten years? Oh that long really? Yeah. Yeah, first year of secondary school, wasn't it? Yeah, that sounds about right. Can you move up to uh, move up north? Yeah, yeah, we moved up to Leeds. That's where I've been since. Leeds, yeah, that's right. Gosh, so what you just down visiting or? Yeah, oh. <laughs> I guess you could say that. I, I just wanted to see the old place again. <laughs> Yeah, well, it hasn't changed much. <laughs> Maybe not, but I think that depends on how you look at things, like your outlook on everything. When you've been away for so long, you tend to view things a bit differently. Take those shops on Regent Road, for example. As a kid, they were filled with treasures that you just had to have, but now you realise a lot of it is just tap, which people buy because they're on holiday, but, but still there's something special about it. Yeah, well, that's one way of looking at it. <laughs> Are you doing anything? It would be great to catch up properly. No, nothing really. What did you have in mind? An ice cream, as <laughs> well. No, I'm down for that. <laughs> you know, I just can't believe that you recognised it. Why is that such a surprise? You don't look that different. I don't know, it's just been so long. You're, yeah, but they do say you never forget your first boyfriend, don't they? Boyfriend? Is that what we're going for? I mean, what, it, it was... We were eight and nine <laughs> at the time. That's what we called it at the time. Yeah, probably. I can still remember that first kiss. Oh, you do? <laughs> yeah, it was quite special. <laughs> I felt so naughty as we stood behind those bushes at the end of your street and just kissed, hoping no one would see us. Oh, yeah, oh, I remember that. <laughs> so you do remember okay, too? Okay, yeah, busted, I remember. <laughs> I mean, I know we were so young and stuff, but it is crazy how I still remember that moment, like, all these years on. I don't even remember how we ended things. Did I dump you? Oh yeah, probably. <laughs> no, no, I don't think it was anything that, you know, one person dumped the other. I just think we grew apart. You know, I think what it was is we went to secondary school, we must have got into different friendship groups, and by the time I realised I hadn't seen you in ages, someone told me you moved up more. Yeah, that's usually how it goes, isn't it? I mean, people come and go from our lives, like, all the time, and they're right for that moment, but one day a friend just becomes a stranger that you used to know. Someone you want to talk to? Nah, find such a restriction. We end up missing out on the moment, don't we? Come on then, lots to do. <laughs> Go on, just a bit. Kind of lost some mustard on the seafront. Oh, I hate it. It just tastes just like dust. <laughs> I love it. Taste of childhood right here. Go on, go on. <laughs> oh, that shows just like that. <laughs> and it's blue. <laughs> oh, it tastes blue. <laughs> oh. <laughs> something else. Let's do something else. Oh, wow. Look in front of you. I'm sure this is the girl. My but she's <laughs> not like for you. <laughs> do it. You are a creep and okay, she's hi. a pearl. You think she looks at me. Am I invisible? She just play with you. I don't know how to do it. You tell me.
to do it I was there, she doesn't care She still ignores me Dancing with her friends God, were you just sick? Yeah, yeah, just a bit. It was probably the candy floss. <laughs> That's what it'll be, the candy floss. Look, do you want to go back to your hotel? If you're feeling unwell, you should just probably rest. What hotel? Sorry, I just assumed that... <laughs> Have you got nowhere to stay? No, I haven't sorted anything yet. I, I just decided I had to come back and see the place, got on the train, and I didn't think that far ahead. It was like one of those spur of the moment things. Living the moment. Yeah, yeah, but what are you going to do? Oh, you know, I'm just turning this thing off. Living in the moment, Jaden. You know, people don't do it enough anymore. People are witnessing great things all the time. They, they live their lives waiting for those great moments, and then they usually miss them because, because they're too busy trying to capture it on their mobile phones. Well, so you've got nowhere to stay then? No, but I, I will sort something. I tell you what, I bet my aunt and uncle won't mind if you stay. I mean, it's one night. That is, if that's something that you want to do. That would be amazing. You know, today has been one of the best days I've had in years, and, and I don't want it to end yet. All right, okay, I'm going to call them <laughs> and check, but it's going to be fine, <laughs> yeah, all right? They're going to okay. let me <laughs> All right. Are you going to be sick again? No. No, that's where my grandma and grandpa used to live. Happy memories. I used to spend so much time with them. They would spoil me constantly. So again, they passed? Years ago. It was just after we moved away. My grandma died then just a few months later my grandpa died too. My grandpa said it was because he couldn't live without her. I've married for 55 years. You. Yeah? <laughs> well, I can see that. I think he looks uh, just like me. <laughs> so, uh, why are you living with your aunt and uncle, if, if you don't mind me asking? Ah, uh, no, it's fine. Um, basically, I fell out with my dad when I was 17, and yeah, he kicked me out of the house, so I had to start surf surfing on, you know, with my friends, and um, well, I even spent a couple of months on the streets. God, that was an experience. Some of the things you see on the streets. Seriously? You, like, actually ended up on the streets? Yeah, yeah. And then I bumped into my aunt, um, by chance, uh, a couple of days ago, and so I've been staying here since. That's... that's awful. So, why was it you fell out with your dad? I mean, he, he always seemed really nice. Don't judge me. I won't. You will. Just say it. 
Okay. When I was younger, I got involved with a bad crowd and I picked up some bad habits. And I stole from him to fund those habits and, well, I got caught and he wasn't very happy and he pretty much kicked me out. Pretty much kicked you out? What does that mean? Well, he said that I needed professional help and because I refused, he said I couldn't stay in the house anymore. Oh. So, it, it's not like he kicked you out for no reason then? Yeah, but I was 17. I had to go to a YMCA for a bit. You know, he shouldn't have done that. Yeah, but it sounds like you were the one refusing help and left him with little choice. Look, I don't want to talk about this. Let's change the <laughs> subject. Uh, can I use your bathroom? Yeah, yeah, it's just um, out there on the right. Is she a kind? Yeah, just think it's something she's eaten. Oh, oh right, okay. Liv? You okay? Yeah. Yeah, yeah, I'll be back for a minute. Oh, that candy floss really took it out of you. I know, right? It'll all be ever seen anyway. Oh, it's probably just one of those 24 hour things. Uh, I... I'm so happy I bumped into you. Today's been the best. Yeah, that's been really fun. Fake, do you reckon? How so? Well, you know, what were the chance that the one time I come back here to visit, I just so happen to see you standing on the seafront in the same place, at the exact same time, after over ten years of not seeing each other. Hmm, when you put it like that, fake, for <laughs> sure. Do you ever think of how things could have turned out differently if you made different choices? Yeah, all the time. But, you know, it's not worth thinking about it too much. Can't go back and change it. No, I know, but it's nice to think about, isn't it? Like, what could have been if we had stayed in touch? If my family had not decided to move away, all those lost years. Still though, I am happy I got to see you one last time. Thank you for an amazing day. It's just what I wanted. A day of fun. A chance to feel normal again. And to find you again after all these years was just a bonus. My first love.